Hey there, Clive Jeffrey here from clivejeffrey.com coming to you again today from beautiful sunny St. Augustine, Florida. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how to create your own personally branded memes using free software and free images. So stay tuned. Welcome back. Now the first thing I do when I start creating a meme is I go and search for a quote and I normally just base it on you know how I'm feeling in the day um, and I'm looking for something inspirational, you know, something that's going to really um, speak to your target audience because the whole idea of, of creating a meme is to, to get um, and connect with your target audience and get a positive message out there, at least that's what I use them for and that's why I like to personally brand them. So I look for uplifting quotes, so um, today I as you can see in here I just go to Google and type in keep going quotes and um, you know and then it, it brings up a whole bunch of different options now just to speed things up I've actually gone through and um, selected what I'm going to do for today and that is um, a quote that I came up with here from Michael J Fox um, and it says nothing is impossible impossible just takes a few more phone calls and I thought wow that's a, a really great quote it speaks to me because it's you know being in the home business and um, network marketing um, arena that speaks volumes you know that's what we have to do we have to keep going we have to keep making phone calls and if we do that we're going to succeed so you know I thought that quote was ideal for what I wanted to do so the next thing I do is um, but you can go and search for anything you want just look for inspirational quotes or whatever you want to put on your meme um, and then the next thing I do is I go and find an image that is going to you know speak about that quote and I use a, a website called Pixabay and um, I will show you that now and then this is where you can get royalty free free images um, it's uh, P-I-X-A-B-Y dot com and um, you know as I say you can get free images royalty free that you can use um, for you know reproduce do whatever you want for your um, memes or anything else online for that matter so this is the image that I'm going to use here. I think it's perfect. So all I do is I click on it, and then I'm down. It says here you can see download for free. I, I just click on it. I always use a, a medium sizes, which is perfect for me. Um, and then it's going to download it. It's going to ask for a, if you you can either set up an account at this stage. I haven't just so that it can show you here. And I just type type in this number for the capture code, which is eight nine. Three one. It just proves I'm not a robot, and I just download it, and it's going to download there, and it's um, all ready to go. So then, what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over to Canva, which is the the software package that I use to create my images in, and that's again a free software. It's called um, Canva.com. So go and set yourself up an account there. C A N V A dot com. And here's just some examples of other memes that I've uh, created. If you want to go and check them out, you can find me on, check them out on my Facebook page or my Twitter, which is all just Clive Jeffrey. Um, so go and by all means search for it there. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up a, a Facebook post. So you know, see how easy it is. It's got them all, you know, everything sized perfectly for you. So I've already clicked on Facebook post and this is going to bring up a blank canvas for me to use here. So I'll just move myself over there a bit. So now I'm going to upload an image, and I just click on upload, and I'm going to upload that image, and it's oh, it's, so sorry, it's going to be from my downloads. Just get rid of that. I'll try it again. Upload. There's my image. I'm going to click that, open it up, and it's going to upload the image which is across here and I just drag it across simple it's so easy to use you know I love Canva I'm a real technophobe so there's there's my image now as I say we want to personally brand it now I said I've got an image of myself in here that I'll just scroll down and find now I've had this one clear cut you can just well by clear cut you'll see what I mean here in a minute it means it's got no background on it and <coughs> this one here I just place myself in the bottom there, you just simply drag it down, size it to how big I want it, which is that's about right for that. And um, it, it, I got a, a 
got a clear cut on on Fiverr. If, if you've not used Fiverr before, it's a great um, website to check out. It's f i v e double -R, r dot com, and you can get anything done for five bucks basically. So go and check that out if you want to get your own image done. Then I'll just place it there. That's all I want to do now. I'm going to go and get my quote. So first of all, I'm going to add it as a add some text. Um, I'm going to add it, add my heading up here, and this is where I'm going to put my text. I'm going to make it spread across the top here, just about all the way to the end. Um, I'm going to select my font. Now it's got a huge selection of fonts. You just scroll through to whatever you like. There's one that I particularly like using. It's called Oswald. Um, so I just click on that. And I'm going to click on this color thing here. I want my text to appear in white. If I wanted any other color, I can just click on the, you know, the color selection. This is going to show up nicely in the background. And then I'm going to go and get my quote. Um, where did it go? Oh, here we go. Um, copy that. Come back over. Get rid of all that. And I'm just going to paste it in. Nothing is impossible. Impossible just takes a few more phone calls. I might just going to drag it up a bit. That's perfect. Now it's important that you always, you know, give credit where credit is due. And so we always put the 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 person who whose quote it is. And again, I'm going to use the font. Um, and I always do it in slightly smaller size just for for balance. I'm going to use Oswald again. Um, again, and I'm going to put it in white. Just get rid of all that text. And Michael J. Fox was the person who's quoted us. And come back in, just paste it in. And I'm just going to I use a slightly smaller font size to size it down to Michael J. Fox. And there we are. Perfect. Now, again, I always put my blog. So, again, I set up another text. I'm just going to drag it down here somewhere. And again, my favorite font, Oswald. There we go. And again, I put it in white again. So clivejeffrey.com is my blog, where, you know, my main business hub, so that's the purpose of that. I'm going to put, put that there, and I'm going to put that down in the bottom corner. So, no, it's a, rather than just sending out, you know, it's, it's always good just to post positive stuff, but if you can personally brand it to yourself like this, you're going to get a, you know, um, the added benefit of leverage if someone else shares the, the quote, and if you do, nice quality ones you know you're gonna I get lots of shares and this way I, I get my face shared and I get my my website shared so um, and it, it's, a, it's a free way to get organic traffic to your blog site so now I strongly recommend doing memes it's obviously not the only thing you want to be doing you want to be providing other kind of value as well but um, it's a good easy way to do and I knock up I, I use this meme I'll use it on uh, my Facebook I'll use it on Twitter and if no, I, I do have an Instagram, but I don't, I've got to start doing that. Um, I haven't been posting there. But um, you, know, you can use it wherever you want. But it's, I just wanted to show you how easy it is to produce these and um, have them branded to yourself. Now, if you have any questions at all or get stuck, reach out to me. Um, you know, you, as I say, clivejeffrey.com. You can reach me there or on Facebook. Again, Clive Jeffrey and any of my social media profiles. So look me up, reach out to me. I'll be happy to help you in any way that I can. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you got some value. If you did, please like and share it. And of course, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Talk to you soon.